If you take a closer look, you'll see these crops are not as they should be. Drought conditions here are a serious problem, and experts say the only way out is heavy rainfall, and lots of it. We'll go take a look. That's crop specialist Angie Reek Hins. We have not had a lot of rain here. And she says the rows and rows of leaves turning brown. If it stays dry, we're going to continue to lose leaves. Are a major cause for concern. Parts of Iowa were put into the D3 or extreme drought category for the first time this year. It's been a while since we've seen that happen. And a lot of that has to do with departure from normal from average rainfall. She says you need about 20 inches of rain per season to grow corn in Iowa. But Iowa Falls is nearly eight and a half inches behind. Eldora roughly 10 inches behind. This is what the yield loss looks like. This is what yield loss looks like. Smaller corn cobs and fewer kernels. She says the amount of rain in the next few weeks will determine how much farmers lose. An inch of rain a week would go a long way. And that's what Iowa Falls farmer Landon Aldinger is hoping for. Well, we've got a little more rain in the forecast over the next, uh, like the 10 days, so that's obviously a positive, and we hope those come to fruition. He says the next two weeks will be critical for this year's harvest and those to come. Any rains that we are short this year, we're setting ourselves short next year going into the start of the season as well. Hopefully we get some timely rains and, and guys will have some corn that's standing there for them in the fall. In Hardin County, Amanda Rooker, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.